your holiness thank you for joining us today your words on the integration of dharma duty earth of wealth karma desire and moksha liberation are deeply insightful could you elaborate on how individuals and society can harmonize these four pursuits gurudev says certainly the essence lies in understanding that dharma earth karma and moksha are not separate entities but interconnected aspects of life dharma encompasses duty and righteousness artha relates to material wealth and prosperity karma signifies desires and aspirations and moksha denotes liberation from suffering and ignorance you mentioned that partnership between individuals and governance is crucial for the attainment of these pursuits could you explain how this partnership can lead to progress and fulfillment when in indeed when individuals and governance work hard and hand in hand societal progress becomes achievable governance should provide a conducive environment for individuals to pursue their goals ethically and honestly conversely individuals should contribute positively to society upholding values of honesty and integrity this partnership fosters an atmosphere where everyone can thrive leading to collective progress and fulfillment your insights on justice and dharma being intertwined are profound how can we ensure that justice prevails in society justice can only prevail when there is adherence to dharma which encompasses righteousness and moral duty it is essential for individuals to uphold truth and integrity in their actions both personally and within their societal structures without dharma there can be no true justice you have emphasized the importance of inclusivity and collaboration in societal development how can individuals and governments work together to ensure holistic progress collaboration between individuals and governments is key to holistic progress government should create policies that empower individuals from all sections of society ensuring equal opportunities for growth and development at the same time individuals should actively participate in nation building efforts contributing their skills and talents towards the betterment of society together they can create a harmonious and prosperous nation where everyone can thrive your words on the significance of freedom and liberation resonate deeply how can individuals attain true freedom in their lives true essence lies and true freedom lies in liberation from the shackles of the mind from desires fears and negative emotions it involves cultivating in a peace and harmony irrespective of external circumstances through practices like yoga and meditation individuals can transcend the limitations of the mind and experience true freedom within themselves your wisdom on integrating dharma earth karma and moksha for personal societal well being is invaluable thank you for sharing your insights with us today it has been my pleasure may these principles guide us all towards a more harmonious and prosperous future jai gurudev